Heidi ho neighbors, Rado Goji here, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate. When we left off, Minsk died, um, and we checked a corpse. And I revived the decayed meme. So this time, we're actually going to see if we can't, um, finish up this area, because there's only one thing left we need to do, and last time it got Jahira killed because of stupid circumstances. And we really need, we really truly do need a better healing spell than Cure Light Wounds. I'm sorry. And this is why I don't really use Jahera as a healer, because she should probably have, you know, she should probably have level three, she would probably have level three uh, spells if she, if she was a full cleric and not a fighter cleric, and she's going to start complaining all the time because of our reputation. But before we get into that... Let's help this guy out. You have to help me! Them Sparts are after my cows again! Sparts are after cow. Uh-oh. This looks like a job for Adventure Party, yes. Hopefully they don't run off this time into uh, ogres and stuff that we don't see coming. They probably will. And they're all attacking the cow. We have to save the cow, basically. I'm going to get rid of as many of these, th in these as many of these things as I possibly can, as quickly as I possibly can. I told you to cast magic missile, Dina Hair. Why are you not doing so? Because the lag may told you that <laughs> probably because the lag told you I said attack, and I totally did not say that, Dinah Hair. I did not. And of course, because oh, we killed our target. We're just gonna sit around like silly nannies. Dear Lord, the AI in this game is. I know that there's like AI settings that you can do, but I found they're kind of pointless in the scheme of things. I like to tell them my, my dudes what to do, and like if I turn the, on the AI stuff, it's just going to be like, okay, we're going to go off and do things you don't want us to do right now. Luckily, we were able to take care of the Sparts this time around. So let's talk to Culric again. Thanks for saving Arabelle here. Ever since them Sparts and their kobold kin swarmed the mines at Nashkale, they've been making attacks like that more and more often. If someone like yourself could get to the bottom of that, all of us trying to make an honest living out here would be sure be grateful. And we get an increase in reputation. The main reason, uh, if you haven't noticed, yeah, Jahira has com started complaining quite a bit, and that's because of our reputation. It's if it ha if it didn't max out now, it has been at max. Because rep reputation is level is measured from 1 to 20. Let's see what ours is. Because we can we can actually check that here. I believe it's 20. Yes, heroic 20. The reason that um, Jahira is complaining about this is because she is true neutral. Uh, Branwyn did this too, did this quite a bit too, and that's why when I, I originally had Branwyn as a, uh, as a healer in my first playthrough, and I eventually had to get rid of her because I was sick of her complaining about her reputation. I didn't mean to bring that up, sorry. But the window thingy down there. The re... The, with a neutral characters... Like, with any kind of character, if, if you go too far past, like, what they like... Like, if you're an evil party and you have a high reputation, or if you have a good party and you have a very low reputation... People will start complaining and then they'll start leaving... Uh, if it gets too high or low, depending on your rep or depending on the alignment of that character, neutral characters do not like it if your reputation is too high or too low. They want it in near the middle. Now Jahir is not going to is not going to leave the party. Basically, if since we do have a even if we have like a like a twenty reputation such as this, she's just going to dislike being in the party because of that. She doesn't like the the re fact that it's more of a good and not a neutral. If now neut even neutral characters will break from the party if they if 
we're doing evil stuff. I'm actually going to quick save here because of bad stuff that happens down here. Quick save. Um, so if we were doing very evil stuff and we had a very low reputation, then yes, Jahera would leave the party. Um, however, even at uh, uh, the highest reputation, True Neutral doesn't leave the party, but they do complain quite a bit. So, you know, first, Jahera complains about the environment, which is, you know, obvious because she is a druid and all. So even if we go into a naturally made cave, she'll complain about that. But we have a very high... Um, we're going to the friendly armen, by the way. We have a very high reputation, so she's just going to complain quite a lot. Even more so than she normally does. I, I believe... Oh, they're really sending our party to the dogs. Ha-cha-cha. Um, but yeah, uh, reputation, I mean, that's, that's why, that's one of the, another reason why I don't like Jahara is because she complains far too much than she needs to. But uh, when your reputation re reaches uh, 19, I believe, that's when uh, neutral people start complaining about your, your, your party being too good, basically. We're going to ignore that, because this is the canon party. This is, you know, main character, Minsk and Dinah here, Khalid and Jahera, and Imowen are the canon party. And the main reason I went with the canon party is because continuity is a very important thing to me. Um, so, like, if I went with, like, another party, like, when I went through the game, when I, went, when I finished the game the first time, I, I haven't finished the expansion ever. But I have finished the main game, and when I finished the main game, my character was pretty much the same. Except instead of Khalid and Jahera, I had Yeslik and Kivan. Yeslik is someone we're going to be meeting later on, but we already have had Kivan in our party. Um, but yeah, um, I didn't want Khalid and Jahera in my party, because in 2nd edition, especially in, in Dungeon... In, uh, not, not Dungeon, in Baldur's Gate, because... Our, our experience cap is very low. We're not gonna, probably not going to be reaching past level 6 or 7. But at that level, druids aren't really that good. Especially if they're, you know, multi-classing fighter druids. Um, druids get really good at high levels, but we won't be reaching high levels until Baldur's Gate 2. And, you know, we're only about a third of... The, I, I checked, we are only about a third of the way through this game. So it's still going to be a while before we finish this game. And even then, I I plan on doing Arena after Baldur's Gate. Uh, before I go, I, I, I after this, I'm basically going to be alternating between. Uh, I I basically have it planned out. We're going to be alternating between these uh, Infinity Engine D and D RPGs and the Elder Scrolls series. So I'm going to be starting Elder Scrolls one after this. I still have to, you know, install Arena. I have Arena downloaded. I have Daggerfall downloaded. I downloaded. I, you know, I said before. I downloaded Morrowind on Steam. Um. Arena and Daggerfall are are free, are free to free to download, so I got those. And then I have Oblivion and Skyrim on my um, on my uh, Xbox, so I'm going to use that for those. I'm actually going to use these this for healing, money for healing, because it's a lot more convenient than healing spells. Okay. I think we can identify a scroll or something. If someone has a scroll, we can identify. It's probably pointless to do so, but... I think I have it now. Maybe Jahara has it now, because Jahara has a lot of Minsk stuff. Do, 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 do. It, it's, it's a, it's, I think it's protection from lightning. At least it looks like a protection from lightning. Um, but it could be one of the... Not protection from lightning. This actually does something completely different. Here we go. Protection scroll. It's supposed to be protection from lightning. Is it protection from lightning? This scroll is cursed. It would be unwise to, unwise to read it, as the effects can prove fatal. It's a cursed scroll of ugliness. So instead of giving us protection from lightning, that scroll will damage our charisma. And um, charisma is very important to me in this game in particular, because if we have higher reputation plus more charisma, we get discounts on stuff. 
Plus, people will like us more. I, I want people to like us. You know, we're, we're good guys. We're super awesome, good guy people. And we want people to like us for it. You know, I guess that's what reputation does. But, yeah. I need to get a, a new mouse, but, you know, money issues and all that. I'm still getting my monies and stuff together. That's just a regular helmet. I thought that was the Helm of Infravision for a second there. I'm like, why do you have the Helm of Infravision plus the Ring of Infravision? You don't need both of those things. That is a silly Minsk. Actually, I'll leave the necklace in here because we're going to sell it in just a second. Okay, we want the ring. We want your ring. And I'm fairly sure that's his Ring of Protection. I don't know why Jahara would have, like, one on and just one in her inventory, so it's probably hers. Or his. It's probably his. Antidote, and this was... A plot MacGuffin, so we're gonna keep that. It's not really a MacGuffin, it's just a... Plot item that we got. That we're gonna hold on to. Because why not? We don't really have much else to do with it. I'm not... don't feel like selling it, really. These are boots of grounding, I believe. Yeah, boots of grounding. Do 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 do. That's why I only had two quick items because Boo is one. Boo, uh, Boo is in one of the slots. I don't know how I forgot about that. Because I'm like thinking, most of these people have healing potions, they have antidotes, and they have um, what do you call it? Uh, stone to flesh scrolls, but. I don't see his stolen to flesh scrolls, so that's right. Because then, then I remember Boo takes up a quick item slot. Oh, Boo. I look forward to many adventures with Minsk and Boo. Because Minsk and Boo are going to be in Baldur's Gate 2 as well. So, yeah. Hooray. In fact, I'm pretty, I'm pretty much going to keep them throughout the... There is no reason not to have Minsk. Minsk is, like, one of the best characters in the game. That's what I believe. I truly believe that. Now, before we go on into the end to sell stuff, I do want to take out all of this... Take, uh, unequip all of the stuff we want to sell. Like, these useless rings and necklaces. That ring is not useless. That's that fire resistance ring. I'm going to keep that on him. Uh, he doesn't have any... Oh, yeah, that's right. He has... The Jair has those. He has useless rings to sell. Salutable items. Do, 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 do you have you have gemstones, so you don't have any of those. You should probably equip that. I know we just got that off that corpse, but she can use uh, more than two healing potions, I believe. She probably got some better healing potions too. I mean, I, I know they're really expensive, but if, if we do get the money, I'll probably get some of those because um, they basically work like because these these potions basically work like cure light wounds. Uh, the other potions I've seen basically work like cure serious wounds. I don't think there's cure moderate. There is there isn't cure moderate in this game. Cure moderate is uh, third edition. Like is I think I believe if I remember correctly, third edition 3.5, and I, I just I just started playing it again. Uh, our our group had a few months where we weren't doing anything, but we're, we've started playing again. But um, I believe there's a. Uh, I don't normally play as clerics, so I don't know for sure. But, um, 3rd uh, Edition and 3.5 have a healing spell for pretty much every spell level for, um, for priest spells, cleric spells. Uh, and I, th I think that the cleric spells still only go up to level 7, um, but we have, like, Cure Minor is level 0, Cure Light, Cure Moderate, Cure Serious, Cure Critical. And there's just one called Heal, which, like, is, like, a super awesome cure-all thing. I'd have to double-check, but... As far as I know, in Baldur's Gate, like, or in, at least in Second Edition D and D, we only have Cure Light, Cure Critical, and or Serious and Cure Critical. If we even have Cure Critical, I, I believe Cure Serious Wounds is a level three spell still, though. Um, but you, you know, probably never know because I, I don't believe Jahir is going to uh, going to be getting third uh, third level spells anytime soon. Because of uh, the fact that she's multi-class and her experience is split among her two classes, she's probably going to have, like, max level four in both of them. 
And I know that Yeslik is a fighter cleric, but he was, he did a better job at uh, d doing cleric -y things, cleric stuff, than uh, Jahera, I think. We're going to hold on to that autogra autograph, too, because, uh, you know, for, for posterity's sake. I mean, we met Harry, we met Larry, Daryl, and Daryl, and I like the fact that we met them, so. I haven't, no, I haven't watched the Bob Newhart show or anything like that, but, um, you know. And uh, we're selling stuff here. I know we're going a little over on time, but that's okay. I'm just going to sell stuff real quickly. And I'm going to rest because um, we've been traveling to... It took, us all, it took us over a day to travel to Friendly Arm, so um, it would be a good idea to rest. That way we don't get fatigued. Because fatigue can affect our... our... Um, our, our mojo, so to speak. Doop, doop, doop. There's that unidentified girdle. I'm going to sell the stagger plus one as well, because she's using a, um... She's using a short sword instead. But I am going to hold on to those boots of stealth, because, um... You know, I don't put too much into stealth, because I don't really use it, but, like, I, I'm, I'm guessing there's going to be, like, one time where I need stealth, and it's not going to let me do it. I guess rest here real quick. What do you have to sell me? A room? We're going to live it up in the royal suite. Hell yeah, it's only eight gold, why not? Okay. So, now that it's night time, <laughs> um, our next destination is actually going to, we're actually going to go to that area north of here again, where we got a Jantus, because um, there's some stuff that we couldn't do because of Ankegs kicking our asses. And we are going to go ahead and give those Ankegs what for. I've been Rado Goji, and I'll be here next time. Join me, won't you?